Hello, Charis. Amen. Praise the Almighty God. Amen. I'm so excited. I'm here at last. Hallelujah. Amen. I've been seeing Mama on, on YouTube. I met an apostle in UK. 2018. Since I discovered Charis in 2016, I've been struggling to make my way here. It has been already impossible. I bless God. But the time I could make my, some money to come here, that was last month, in, that was in February, I made my way. I reached at the airport just here Johannesburg. I was returned back. I went back in tears. Hallelujah. More airport in February. Ba fetcha ba na mecha flighte ngo wa mposhe chaga yepilo aka nile butlo kukelela dikeleed. Yes. Now, when I reached home, I was very much distressed. I ke fetcha ga yepilo aka bele butlo ku. I told my wife. I need God first. Let me just separate myself. I took, I took some another three days alone. Praying to God. And the, when I finished, I went back home. I wanted to start working. But my determination was to get money and make my way back. The first journey on the road, the car got an accident. Someone who hit the car from the sides. I said, God, what's, what's happening now? In a minute of asking myself, Questioning God. God, God. God told me. Someone approached me. Oh, in a vision. He was talking to me with authority. He made a statement. He said, Nothing can manipulate me. I say, okay. He said, if River Nile can be blocked, what about Lake Victoria, which is the source, which is left at large? I understood the message. I, 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 put, I put myself together and went back to start working. Afterwards, before I knew, the insurance, insurance brought back the same car to me. Brand new car. So I thank God that's a testimony. Then I started looking for money to get a ticket to come back this way. I had to look for a visa. I struggled to get a visa. It was like the devil never let it go. The visa office, they twisted me here and there. I almost gave up. Until I discovered a link for VIP visitors. For VIP visitors. I went there and I paid the money. I got a visa. I got a visa. And now this is my first time to be in this place. And I really God. I've made it. I've made it this time. Only I've made it. It's really unbelievable. How many years are those? I thank God for the blessing we've been receiving on YouTube. 
My wife got delivered there and then. Just looked at, at the screen where I was watching. She got her deliverance. Hallelujah. Amen. So I said to her, I must reach there. I must go there. And if she's there, I know she will she watch me. She, she's now seeing me. If, if we are, if we are alive. She cannot miss watching me. Amen. And I thank God and I know and I know. Um, since I'm here, Amen. life is not going to stay the same. Amen. I'm a pastor in the UK, but it's not easy. Amen. And I know that when I get there, I will be able to do it. Amen. Amen. And I said to her, I must reach there. One last thing. When I entered here, the peace I found in a room was, was amazing. Amazing. I said to myself, now this is, this is it. This is it. I just started worshipping. Before I knew, I fell asleep. I fell asleep. A lady came to register me. She knocked, knocked, knocked. I could not hear anything. I was already gone. I was gone. And in the process, I thank God, it's another testament. I got a visitation. Man of God, the light, the light came to me in the room where I was staying. Very heavy light. I could not look into it. I just put my hands there. Closing my eyes. In the same time, in a vision, someone was knocking. And in my spirit was saying, no, Go away, I don't, I don't want to miss this. Go away, I don't want to miss this. Go away, I don't want to miss this. And all of a sudden, I beeped, I saw them. All of a sudden, in a mirror, in a, in a window. And I, I go, go, go. They were two ladies. One lady told her, you will come back tomorrow. Then they left. And then I stayed there and enjoyed the presence. Today, when they came to register me again, I didn't know there were the very people who were knocking. I started meditating and said, oh, my spirit was awake. So these are the people who came to register me. I was telling them, go away. So, and indeed they heard in the spirit. <laughs> they walked away. They left me in peace. So I, thank, I really thank God. I know, I know, I know I'm not the same even right now. But Amen. just here, coming here. Amen. I was hearing testimonies and... Uh, I had my brother. When did you did we meet in the UK? When? Which year? 2018, I think. 2018. Where? When you you came to? Yeah. Yes. But we, I forgot. It's a long time. Yes. Now let's clap hands for everyone. <laughs> Can you hear people? I excited that they are here. Like this man, the way he's speaking, he's so excited that I'm, he's here. And there's some people here, you've been here. From Ivory Park, you've been here. <laughs> For how many years now? You've been here from Ivory Park, nothing is happening. Someone says, I just come here. Listen to that woman who says, I've come here. When I was thinking, I would be touched. The anointing just locate me like that. There's something here. If you listen to this way, can you stand up, sir? How many times you are coming here? Many times. Where do you come from? From Cape Town. From Cape Town, many times. But someone is coming from Madiba Drive. 
I, I don't understand. You can sit down. Someone is coming from a diva drive in zone 10. Winnie Mandela. Someone here many times flying, coming here as a visitor. Look at this man, how excited he was. Where do you come from? Eh? We, just come from Angola. Huh? we just come from Angola. He's coming from Angola. By bus. Huh? By bus. How many hours? We did four years. Five years. Ah, oh, five days. Five days. Coming by car. By bus. Yes. From Angola. They are just coming from Angola. Five days by bus. You. Are uh, you people? Uh, ask myself, why are you here? What is it that you are searching? Someone five days inside the bus. When did you move from Angola? Uh, myself, I come from Wij at the north, and he comes from BA. Your, Wij? Wij, yes. Wij uh, in Angola? Wij in the north, the north the province. North. Yes, and, and he's from, from BA. From? BA. BA. BA, we have in the middle of Angola. It's coming from BA. <laughs> yeah. In the middle of Angola. This man is coming from BA. In the middle of Angola. Even some names you don't want to hear. It's a place where they come from. And you, you are coming from here. This really shocked me sometimes. For this man to have five days. Look at this man. So where do you come from? In Deben. How many times you are coming here? Many times. From Deben. This is really a shame to us. You are coming from where? Uganda, Kampala. Uganda, Kampala. This man is coming from Uganda, Kampala. The one who was giving you a testimony. That God gave him a, a son. And now, also, you got a new job. Uganda, Kampala. And now, you're coming from Winnie Mandela. Ivory Park, Clayville. We need to change. We have to be the ones when we come here, we become, we believe serious. We must believe. These people are coming from far. Do you have other people who are coming from far? You lift up your hands. If you are here, you are afraid to lift up your hands, isn't it? Right. Yeah, because you are coming from Cape Town. Right. Where do you come from? I came from Cape Town. Cape Town. You come from Cape Town. My brother, where do you come from? Western Cape. Western Cape. I, I, I normally think that... Uh, you people here, you know I've been here for many years, isn't it? Now, you hear someone coming say, it's the first time for me, I wanted to come here, and then now this, and then I'm here, this happened to me. And you find that you have been here for all these years, and nothing happened. I begin to question, is it our minds, or... Are we having unbelief? Can you, can you believe someone who can say, this man is a witch? Can you believe something like that? You're, you're, you're in a church where already you've seen one, two, three. Not only here in South Africa. You can hear this man say in the UK. Can you just come say, you? If I'm working with this man like this all the time, what is inside me must enter him. I don't know if you're hearing me. If we walk, we are together, agree. Because belief is agree. The Bible says, believe what? The prophets, and you shall prosper, isn't it? In other words, agree with them. You can prophesy because of that. When you are working with them, there are times where your life comes. Let's go back. 
There are times where your situation will go back like this. Don't go ahead of them. Just believe them and walk with them. If I have this man and we are working together like this, it is possible that I can begin to feel what this man is feeling. People are spirits, are not flesh. If this man is having a spirit of lust and I work with him, I'll begin to, what is of looking around, I'll begin to look around. Are you hearing me? People can transfer each other's spirits. You cannot be here for all these years and you don't have our spirit. You can see that. You cannot work with us all the time. You dream people chasing you. You dream people chasing you. You can't even dream a member of the church that you must pray for that member. We are here with you. No vision, no dream, nothing. It means your belief is not fully set.